hole and another hurdle. This time it's Childers, redshirt junior. Here's the kick. Demas back deep from his three. Going to the wide side, well trapped down. Iowa special teams, another area. There's a late fumble. Are they going to say that's a live ball? They may, but that, Let's that's see. unfortunate because they, they played it with great leverage. I thought he was down. Caught only six passes in three years playing for the Fighting Illini. Had four for the season coming into play tonight. Oh, great play. Toa Tawa. He took the blocker, got rid of him, and then made the tackle. Watch this kind of all at the same time. Well done. Well done. 35. Simon. The throw. Quick catch and a first down and more. Joshua Young. Blood and the ball is out. Fumble is scooped up. And there's a lot of space. And another touchdown. Kayvon Merriweather. The scoop and score for the Hawkeyes. And, and, and there it is again. You see Young Blood. You think it's a first and ten. And then Castro. Out of the bullpen, probably in because Terry Roberts and a shuffle around. Kayvon Merriweather doing his thing. Hit me right away in the backfield. It was Merriweather. Badger back to do so. Third and four here. And that is complete to Skyler Bell. First down, Bulls down. DK Johnny on the spot. It's going to go in the books as a six. Well, they've made their one, and Iowa's offense couldn't get a first down. Kaliak Manis. Oh, that they ball is tipped into the air. air. And here wow. come the Hawkeyes. Jack Campbell with the return. Look at him go. He's still on He's his going feet. To score. He's going to take it to the wow. house. Hello. How <laughs> do you do? <laughs> Got a marker down. Take a look right here. That's the center, Schmitz. That had gotten a hand on him, and did he step out? Oh, no, I don't, oh, I don't know. think he. I don't think he stepped out. I don't out. know. I, I don't. don't I don't I, think he stepped out. I don't think him. so either. I don't think he stepped I out. I think if they review it, Spencer, and they may, I'd be surprised if they didn't. They're going to find that. Um, that it's going to be a pick six. Yep. Jack Campbell knows how to run with the football here. Watch him walk this tightrope here on the sideline. After the breakup here, wow. wow, bounces right in his head. We just said that they yes. got four. Uh huh. <laughs> he's done it without put, make it, putting himself in a vulnerable situation. And one of the best games he's played as a Husker. Anthony Grant tracked down to the backfield by Sebastian Castro. Has their hands full this afternoon with this stout Iowa defense. Third and long. Wade slipped on his plant foot, gets it outside, complete to Robinson. Can Kentucky convert on this third down. What a play by Sebastian Castro. And when you can get a young quarterback to hold the football and then start patting the ball and then tapping his feet, and then you just kind of like flex. Never double dip the chip. Go to the outside. Bowman stopped in his tracks. High snap. Got it into Vaughn's hand. In open space. He does stuff like this all the time. This is where it says the numbers are three on really one. That's two guys blocking Castro. He says Broncos three out of four with third downs here today already. Pressure coming. And Western Michigan gets rid of it, but well short of the first down. Castro right there may have had an opportunity at another pick six, just like he had last weekend, his first career interception. He's a basketball guy. They get to Berger. Came with all sorts of time. It's intercepted. Threw it across the field, and it's taken away for the second time. Tyler Fisher coming on the blitz. Now watch 37. He's picked up by Berger, but he gets enough in the way of the quarterback. The ball is underthrown. That ball has to be thrown out to the sideline. But the pressure in Kim's face, it was an underthrown ball to the inside and well played by Sebastian Castro. He had a pick six that was huge in the win. Huge explosive chunk play. He was battling with a very good corner, Cooper DeGene, for the Iowa Hawkeyes. And that is overwhelmed by Sebastian Castro. What a play on Pauling. 
It's why in the last four years, Iowa has allowed the second fewest points per game to just Georgia in the country. This is Aker again, and it's Castro once more. So he's out, Aker back in, and it's Aker out of the backfield. Jeez. And Aker is sliced down by Castro. So good. Nickel linebacker just defeats the block outside. That's a true freshman in Ashcraft. Ashcraft trying to block him. He can't. Nobody can. To have a big reason why they were an offer on the scoreboard. Raylan Allen trying to get to the outside, and he's tripped up by Castro. Just cartwheeled him down. And... Iowa rushes four. Still nearly gets there, and this is caught, but it looks like it's a yard short for Skyler Bell. They just feel like they're everywhere. There is never just a wide open anybody. Here comes Craig. He hit him, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Castro, and how fitting is that? Deontay Craig's coming around. He's into the quarterback. He hits, he impacts the throw, and who's on the other end? Sebastian Castro with his the intangible elements that are necessary to be a consistent quarterback performer. And around, and met in the backfield. Doesn't get past the 22-yard line. Daniel Jackson, their number one wide receiver, meets Sebastian Castro. Daniel Jackson, their most targeted receiver, wears number nine, hasn't caught a pass yet. Oh, this is Taylor. Rocked down at the 25. He won't get there. No game. Castro and Jackson keep it that way. Comes through right there. Tyler into a big pile. Barely made it back to the line of scrimmage. It might be the last play and likely will be the final play. And they pick it up after the run. Now inside Iowa territory. Taylor cuts it back. Castro is there. But he drags him down to the 42-yard line. 39-yard passing play, the longest of the season for the Gophers yet. Kaliak Vanis keeps it himself and brought down. On occasion, it looked like the Iowa defense was perhaps going to over-pursue. A lot of the eyes going in that direction to Castro. Paddock under center. Quarterback sneak. And they stop him behind the line of scrimmage. What a play. Cap at the top of your screen, two receivers to the bottom. And Purdy roaming to the right side. In a little bit of trouble, he throws it forward. It's loose, and it's recovered by Jay Higgins. In the field. Take a look at this. Fumble. We'll look at it again. Oh, he did defense. try to throw it. That'll First be a down, really Iowa. interesting call. Time out the field. Yes, yeah, Sebastian Castro was pursuing. Can Iowa get off the field? McCarthy finds Donovan Edwards. No room. Edwards maybe a yard and a half. Castro there. And Michigan will have to punt. Most of their top players are here playing in this game. Play fake to Sampson. Yamaliava throws all the way across the field and a completion. Good open field tackle. Chaz Nimrod with the catch again of eight. They did blow the whistle. Let's see if he gets the ball here on third and one. He does. And trying to push his way forward. Got close. It's going to depend on the spot. I don't think he got there. 